All right, guys, welcome back to RimWorld. Uh, I just looked it up, and uh, apparently Kibble's made out of vegetable and meat sources. That's important, both of them. Though, we are running out of food once again. Uh, we need to do some hunting. Despite the fact I have all this... I, I, I didn't actually think I'd depend this much upon hunting. Maybe I should make even more places. I, I think it's because the corn hasn't really grown. I think that's the main issue. So let's get Wikidoo. I don't know what Wikidoo's doing, but he can do that now because that's actually already here for me. We're gonna hunt a shit ton of things. So this is gonna be like a little battery room, and you'll see what I'm gonna do for that. It's gonna be amazing. You guys will love it. So that's gonna be okay. How big is this one? Oh, we should make a nice thing out of wood here, actually, to be honest. So we kind of just need to finish up the wall here, and then we make a nice door. I don't know how to get in here. Like right here, because we don't need to actually come in here that often. We'll be fine. A nice heat. I mean, there's beds that are supposedly supposed to be made, but they're not being made right now, so it's whatever. So corn, corn I've learned is something that um, it it has a lot higher food yield than potatoes do, so it's actually kind of worth it to make. And apparently it has HP that's really low, so that's kind of nice. Six HP on this one, fucking hell. Non ideal temperature growth multiplier. It's like eight degrees. I mean that should, should still be fine. There's outages over here. It's oh, you know what? I just realized a fucking wood problems here. To be honest, this is not that important, but I don't know if I should even be bothering with this, to be honest. Because we've actually technically already moved everything. Yeah, we're trying to move everything, so you know what? It's fine. I'm, I'm tired of that thing right now. We have, we have still have these stools. So we're cutting wood. Um, I probably should reinstall these guys over here, though. B right here. This one over here. We're gonna make like proper chairs, but we don't have to do that right now. There we go. And we'll also bring this stool over here. We'll make nice, comfortable chairs. Also, this is my favorite song in this entire game right now. It's playing. It's actually quite a nice song. Why are you eating that? Consuming pork. Okay, you know what, Pat? You know what? It's not Pat, it's canned. He's eating pork. <laughs> you know, sometimes you just can't prevent people from doing things like this. Yeah, like, there's perfectly good food, and it's like, yeah. Wait, why are you bringing this here? Wait, wait, this is a butchering table. Why, why bring it over there? Oh, because there's no bill for it. Oh, one sec. You stop that right now? I didn't actually realize that. I fucking didn't remove these. Yeah, get rid of those. Uh, yeah, butcher creature, do it forever. Uh, cook simple meal, do it forever. Okay, my bad. My bad. I blamed the game for this, and uh, actually I wasn't really blaming it. I was, I was questioning myself slightly. Feeling terrible, ugly environment. Yeah, whatever. There we go. What? What the fuck, Wiki? Wiki, what? What? What are you doing with that? I just thought. I just saw you use. I, I, I just saw you take that. Can you haul it back? And Pat, get the fuck back here. Can I forbid people from taking things like that? Because seriously, just he just scoops it up. Okay, thank you. That's really weird. Cause it's like we're in the middle of trying to make food. Where, where am I? Am I hunting? Good. Oh, whoa, there's a lot of wood here all of a sudden. And it's raining, thank thankfully. It means zero risk of fire now, guys. Alright, tattered apparel. We're gonna have to deal with that pretty soon, aren't we? Why where's Pat going? Training Ares, okay. We have a dog named Ares. Who the fuck plays Final Fantasy? Actually, you know what? We can 
We can toggle these turrets off. They simply do not have to be on. All right, so we're pretty good with this guy right here, almost. We're gonna let that finish though. Who's our best construction person? I think that's me, to be honest, but now Kand is actually pretty good at that stuff. But Kand's priorities, okay, Kand's priorities have to be on constructing. But he's right now sleeping, so. Because it just, it, it just occurs to me, like, all this stuff is just sitting here with blueprints, right? And I'm like, well, who's the main person who's going to do that, right? They have to have a slightly higher priority to construct anything that needs to be made. And, uh, Ken is the best for that. It's particularly someone who you don't want to, um, Warg Revenge. Warg is attacking after being harmed. Oh, what Pe oh, Pepe came with me. Oh, Pepe's running away. Uh, let's see, injured. Can you just shoot it? Okay, I guess not. Taking potatoes. Why is that important rather than the fucking dealing with the war? Who knows? So, Pepe is a useless piece of shit. Uh, let's get Necromantic Cat to... Oh, Witchell's gonna actually haul that. Not bad. I just keep seeing animals just randomly kind of like everywhere and this wood is also exposed to elements, so that's also great. Ares has gotten uh, food poisoning from potatoes. Okay. Yeah, we have a bit of an issue here with power. Look at this shit. It's just like the windmills aren't going, nothing's going right now. Let's, let's, you know, let's, let's get a battery on this network, honestly. Uh, I don't know where to put it, though. Put it, like, right here, actually. Actually, prioritize the battery. We really need that battery over there. Actually, do, do we concert, do we keep the power in there is the question. I'm actually worried. Oh, we do, actually. Look, it, it hooks up uh, to our network. Uh, because if we actually look at, um... The power network here, see? It does that. This is going to be where our actual batteries are going to be. We're going to have two sets of batteries, and you guys are going to see why I'm going to do that. Um, hopefully all in due time, but we should be okay. My cloud is fully healed. It's good to know. We're also going to need two beds here. Uh, maybe, yeah, maybe two. The reason I'm going to make beds here is going to be for doctoring. I think we have enough wood for this now. We should, we should close this guy. We have 504 wood. So the problem right now is, how do we get Ken to, to do most of this stuff? I mean, he, his, his priority is now pretty high on this stuff, so it's pretty good. Ah, he's going to actually... Okay, why are you taking the materials like that? Wow. As like the worst shit imaginable. And right, we're just gonna chillax. Yo, we need we need a fucking pool table. I have just decided this. Where's our where's our pool table? Alright, we need We need cloth. Fucking hell. How much cloth do we have? Major break risk? I don't give a fuck. Uh it's Pat. It's Pat gonna break about now. He's slow poke. Yeah, no. Feeling bad. Like, literally, there's nothing wrong with... We need smoke weed. I've just determined this. We'll make, like, a shit ton of smoke weed, right, like, right here. Oh, this is a stockpile zone. Whoops. That's not what I intended to make. Not, do we really need this much smoke weed? I don't, I don't know how much we need. I'm, I'm experimenting. But there we go. Smoke weed. Right there. We should probably also haul this away. Oh, actually, all of that should leave. I'm hearing something dying. Oh, who knows? What the fuck is dying? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, okay, Alexa just killed a fucking deer. Actually, let's hunt that right. That, let's hunt that asshole. It's nice. All right, so these are going to be medical beds. 
the basically when people need to go get healed, they go in here. It's a nice, sterile room. Is there a roof on top of that room, though? Uh, there is not a room. Like that, you see that this is already expanded for this, so I don't know why people don't work on the roof right away, but I know how roofs work. Like, I don't know why this wasn't the priority. Because, like, oh, I actually don't have heat coming into here either. I just realized that. Okay, let's uh, let's actually take care of that uh, pretty soon, actually. We need a vent, you see, coming through this guy. Because this is going to be 19 degrees. I mean, that's not so bad because the door keeps opening, but... It's still something you want to eventually deal with, you know? Holy shit, there's a lot of animals here. Uh, we should actually prioritize the butchering table. And I'm gonna say make kibble. Oops, don't butcher creature. Make kibble. Uh, until I have... I don't know how many I need, but we'll say, let's say 10 maybe. I wonder how the kibble works. Alright, so... They to I told him to... Actually, let's, uh, let's uh, put a higher priority on the making of the kibble. Because I want to actually see how that works. Okay, apparently it will not, uh, it's still, it's supposed to be uh, a combination of vegetables and, um, let's, uh, let's, uh, cancel this for a second. I'm going to suspend that. Okay, apparently Pat will just not do it. Need materials for kibble. How much potatoes and shit do you need? Who the fuck even knows? Okay, don't suspend it anymore. What the hell is Pat doing? Okay, whatever. Cook. Cook until we need you for something else. I think that- oh man, the corn is actually grown. It is truly a Christmas miracle on this day. Who's our growing person? That would be a necromantic cat. That should be his number one priority, to be honest. Hera 1 is being attacked by a timber wolf. Stun! Alright, let's go protect Hera 1. Oh no! Dead. Whatever, it's a fucking bunny. Fuck that Timberwolf. Pepe, why? Ah uh, no, he's 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 because he's like a stand for the sniper rifle. All right, there we go. Did he just he just fucking ate the hair? Like what the fuck? Okay, can you like not like haul this? Like it's food, dude. All right, who's our, uh, who's the guy who grows things? That would be Necromantic Cat. The real question we ask ourselves is, why, what the fuck is, he's playing horseshoes, okay. Well, that's, I, I'm sure that's acceptable. No, it's not actually. And there's actually one more thing we want to grow here. We want to grow cotton for our pool table. Um, why we need cotton for a pool table? That's a good question. A question for another time, guys. We don't even need that much, I think. Actually, maybe we need a little bit. I don't, I don't fucking know how much we need, actually, to be honest. I'm starting to I'm starting to be retarded about where I grow things, aren't I? Whatever, who cares? Here's where the this is the cotton fields. As I said, I don't think I actually need that incredible map, but I may grow some more later. Look at that! Look at, oh my god, we got corn up the ass now. Okay, we really actually need that light in there. It's ridiculous. We can stall over here. We, we should also get another light in here somewhere, because I, I kind of want lights in this place. Standing lamp over here wouldn't be bad. Yeah, you prioritize that guy. Because we're not, we have no reason to come up here anymore. There we go. Look at that, maybe we can get another light like up here or something. So we get like two lights? Are, are we a two light kind of uh, kind of base here? Honestly, I think we're I think we're just spoiled at this point. What the fuck? Oh yeah. Maybe like that. 
Actually, no, I think that's a little bit too close. Yeah, that's too close. I think Wiki's got it, though. I think we also need, like, a nice road to get him. Look, look, look how slow they go when they go across this. So we have to consider de rezoning that, to be honest. I'm hoping that we just take these uh, pieces of corn, though. Where's Necromantic Cat? Okay, good. He's oh, dude, he's he's growing the smoke leaf. Clearly, his priorities are in order. He knows what's up. Why why are you hauling things? Aren't you supposed to be doing uh, growing? Doesn't growing entail uh, taking down that shit? Whatever, I guess not. All right, so we have uh, an alp. Paka is pregnant. All right, so that just means more food. I mean, as horrible as that sounds. We're gonna maybe do a, uh, some paved tiles or concrete. We'll just make uh, a nice road to this. That's what I'm thinking. It does however mean that we have to remove uh, some of the growing zone. There we go. What's gonna happen with this? Is, is someone gonna actually harvest that or what? Oh wait, wait, do we do we make kibble yet? Oh, kibble! Oh shit! And how much kibble does that count as? Fifty. Good. Uh, d d do we want just fifty? I mean, we should do that kind of. I think maybe plus twenty-five. Yeah, maybe like. A minimum 35. It actually worked. Now we have something to feed to our animals. Awesome. Now we have a nice path in between this and these two places. We're almost a real colony, guys. Now I'm surprised that nothing came and tried to fuck me up this episode. I mean, that last one. I think it's making up for the last episode where it was like, literally everything, everything tried to fuck me up. Alright, we're going to actually add something new to this. Uh, cooking skill 10. How good is Pat at cooking, actually? Is he- is he shit at cooking? He's five? What the fuck? How have we not gotten a master chef here? Apparently- okay, apparently we do not have a very good chef here. I mean, it's Pat. So, actually, we're gonna do fine meal. None of my col colonists can do that. Okay, we can only do that so much. Alright, until we have 10. Uh, but Pat will not even do fine meals, so... Despite the fact he's gotten this much practice with cooking... Uh, it's just no. Looks like we're, uh, we have no choice in this matter. Alright, I'm gonna make actually two more floorings. Um, one here, one here, and then I think we're good. Because I just know it's like dirt where the fucking floor is right there, like that. There you go, see? And it turns into a real floor. What are, what, do people get like these beauty things from this place? Feeling good. No, it's just not a beautiful place, apparently. All right, we have enough light here and everything. It's This is actually pretty awesome, this this colony. All right, so let's do some more nice-to-have things, shall we? So because we're doing so well, uh, I mean, the power thing is coming together. Uh, as I said, I think I can a smelter, maybe. Uh, I'm thinking about making the, the comms console. Yeah, we're gonna do that. And also, we'll make some nice chairs, too. Those are comfortable chairs. A herbalist named uh, Kepler Sartu calls from nearby. They're being chased by pirates from the Tiger Men. Uh, he begs for safety. He's 44 years old. We will offer safety. Alright. Yeah, we're pretty good here. Um, we are gonna have to, though... Not right now, but soon. We're gonna have to. We're gonna make, make these turrets go farther out. And the reason why we have to do that is because um, if anyone has grenades, they're gonna kill basically our corn and crops and things like that. They're attacking immediately. All right, let's see what, what we have. So it's a guy with a toothbrush. Is that a toothbrush? What the fuck is that? It's a silver mace. Uh, they just all have like shit weapons. All right. Well, let's bring them over here and fuck them up. Uh, Wiki do also has a rifle. 
Uh, what's Kepler good for? Uh, dude, really good at growing, really good at medicine, really good with animals. Uh, no cooking, and actually pretty good. This is actually a good all-around person, physically dull. So, no, psychically, sorry, not physically dull. Uh, it's degrading to, it's, it's degrading to have a less impressive bedroom than someone else. You get some mood loss of any, any colonists is a better room. What an asshole. But he can shoot, which is better than I can say for most people who we have here, so... We're gonna get him to take that thing. Yeah, we already know there's a raid. Uh, we'll go like... Where are these guys? Alright, they're coming. What the fuck are you fucking up my animals for? Hey. Well, it's fucking dead now. Okay, so they're just gonna, f like, kill the animals. I, I swear to god, like, these animals have to go somewhere else, I think. Actually, j just those ones need to leave. Yeah, I think they're- I think it's dead. Fuck the alpacas, whatever. Yeah, let's get over back here. Oh, they're attacking Witchell. Can you flee up that way? Like, towards, like, the gunfire? Oh, Witchell's down. Okay. You wanna rescue Witchell? Is that everyone? Uh, yeah, they're fleeing now. Alright, we're good. Hey, Kepler, you wanna rescue this guy? Or capture this guy, actually. And take his toothbrush with him. All right, so who's gonna be the name of our new colonist? All right, let's see. I'm gonna, as I said, I'm gonna name people. So we have names for everyone. This is gonna instead of Kepler, it can be a I don't know. How about a how about Master Fiddle? You're in the comments. There you go. Nickname is now Master Master Fid. <laughs> oh, Master Fid, welcome to the colony. <laughs> gonna be your death your death sentence. Yeah, there's a bit of a issue here. We actually have to zone a stockpile zone actually here for a uh, for med kits. And what we're gonna do here is we're gonna allow just uh, medicine here. Who's our doctor gonna be? So fucking Matt Fiddle here is an amazing doctor, an amazing herbalist person, uh, and. Really good at not much else. So. We'll, we'll put everything like that. There we go. I don't know why Cand is doing this. I mean, you know what? It's fucking Glitter World Medicine, so it's really difficult to screw up anyways. Probably need a bigger fridge than this, to be honest. I'm, I'm not gonna be. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. And right, we captured this guy. Yeah, this guy doesn't get anything. Oh, we can start actually deconstructing some of this stuff too, actually. Because we're gonna get a shit ton of materials out of this stuff. What the fuck is the turtle doing here? Who even knows? So we just lost like both of our alpacas. Hey, look, he's got like regular medicine. That's awesome. Uh, we should strip that guy, though. Is that everybody? Yeah, I guess it's everyone. So, if we make this slightly farther away, we can kind of make a nice border, like, we can build a nice wall around our, um, place here. Like, that's why I kind of chose this place, because it has defensive walls as it is, which is nice, so... You know. It's one of those things to take into account. I shouldn't have built the cooler here. I should have actually built it on that side, but whatever, you know. What? We have kibble here for you. Oh my god. My glass gotten poisoning. Kand is uh, walking around in sadness. Oh, uh, because he's wearing shitty apparel. That's something we should also probably take care of fairly soon. We're going to actually build a bunch of these structures for this purpose, though. Um, we don't need a plant pot. It's a it's actually a production building. So two things. There's a stonecutter stable, but that's this thing is fucking huge, though. Holy shit. 
we can build it like right here or something. Maybe like right there, stone cutters right there. And then where's the place that we can do uh, electric uh, tailoring bench? It's gonna have to be on this wall. Uh, oh, we actually almost am done with this place. I haven't quite decided how it's gonna work, but it's gonna work somehow. Need to put some power circuits going this way. And we're gonna deconstruct this one. What the fuck? The fuck is going on? They have like bullet holes in them and they're fucking. What the hell? They have like cut wounds. Oh, because I made them go over here. Maybe they shouldn't be here. That's why. I'm surprised they're even still alive, to be honest. Wool growth. Oh, they grow wool for me. Neat. Yeah, I think I need to, every time that something comes and attacks us, we gotta, like, move everything away. But anyway. I haven't decided where the tailing bench is gonna go. Probably over here. Or, sorry, like, somewhere over here. Soon. Uh... I don't even know. Why did, why did I break this open? Mad animal. Local timber wolf has gone crazy. Yeah, well, they often attack when harmed. Actually, you know what, to be honest? Let's, uh, kind of hang out here. And also, wait, wait the animals can't have to fuck, have to come back, I think. Because I think... Yeah, there it is. Where am I? Yeah, see, these turrets are crazy. There we go. We'll just kill it. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it. One shot to the end. One of my uh, machines has broken down. Okay. That'll be this guy. Can't has to fix it up. Mental break. Fire starting spree for what? For Witchell? Oh. Nurse he is. Just gonna just follow him around. We can try and arrest him. Okay, let's, let's try and arrest him. You're under arrest. There we go. <laughs> all right, that that. All right, well, I mean, he's he's incapable of violence, so that was an easy way of dealing with him. Wait, we have to recruit him again? Yeah, he got removed from my thing because we arrested him. What the fuck? That's actually the stupidest thing I've ever seen. All right, so for this guy, we're gonna chat this guy and recruit him too. I mean, we have a really high. He's got a low uh, low uh, recruitment difficulty. Maybe that wasn't worth it to do. Someone was talking, oh wow, we just threw up in the cornfield. Nice. Why? Food, oh, because of food poisoning. Well, I, you know, I think I see the problem with the why the food is such low quality. I think it's right there. You're fucking throwing up in the corn. These fucking guys. Thankfully, we have heal root coming along, though, so. We should be okay real, real soon. This kind of stuff. Oh, there we go. Master Fiddle's uh, feeding the animals here. Oh, good. Someone can work on the fire foam thing issue here. What am I doing? Oh, deconstructing the bench. I was a miner. Yeah, we just don't need this stuff anymore. So, like, it gives us a, a fair bit of our resources back. So, kind of why we decided to do this. I honestly wish that my character would just finish mining, so you know what? You fucking prioritize that. What's the mining on? Put it on number... no, put it on number one for myself. Shoot, no, number two is fine. Construction should be number three. Hauling should also be number three. Violet is pregnant. What the fuck? What the fuck? What did you fuck? Uh, I guess another dog somewhere. Uh, the dog that you're not with right now. How, uh... How embarrassing. Uh, we're low medicine. We already know this. We also have really serious tattered apparel issues right now. It's not the best issue, either. Um, what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to make, like, a junk pile. Actually, I'm going to start doing that. 
So this is going to be for all our junk clothing. Um, so one of the things you can do in this game, so I'm going to disallow all. I, like we kind of don't give a flying fuck about things that are really broken down in terms of apparel. So we say apparel, so this includes all the headgear and stuff like that. What we're going to say is if the, if it's below, is it 50% or low, maybe 60% or lower hit points, you put it there instead. And it's going to be a preferred place for that stuff. So basically all the clothes are going to just be moved over here. This is the stuff that nobody wants to wear. All right, it's going to be exposed to the elements, but I don't really give a fuck about it. Like it just, it's wasting space here. We don't need it. We're just going to get rid of it. All right. And that's, that's how we're going to deal with that. That's it. And so as soon as the, uh, fucking hell, I mean, want to reinstall this battery somewhere. Maybe put the battery over here for now. In the room beside the bore. Let's work on that for a sec. There we go. Alright, so... Now, because I moved that around... The reason why I want to move that around is because I want to get the, um... Electric smithy? No, the electric tailoring bench. Yeah, we can make it a wood, that's fine. We'll get that done over here. We're gonna make some nice chairs too, and then stools for whenever anyone wants to work on something. What? <laughs> Recruiting chance needed on Witchel, huh? I didn't know that you'd have to recruit someone back. It's actually pretty, that, that's pretty bad for us to be doing that. I mean, I, is he pissed off? I, I wonder, actually. Yeah, we shouldn't have arrested him. He's imprisoned, damn. I mean, our, our, our choice of jail cell isn't exactly the, the, the best in the world. Oh, oh, we just got access to the comms console now. Nice. Alright, and with that, we have to basically do one more thing. Uh, there's actually something really nice about the comms console. We need to make a... Where is it actually? Uh, is it miscellaneous? Yeah, it is. Actually, we... Oh, fuck. I did not make a multi-analyzer, did I? Wow, okay. Everyone ignore me. Apparently, I don't know what I'm talking about when it comes to this game. We all need that. Um... We need to make a, a, oh, okay, that's, actually I need to do it like this. We need to make it right here. And the reason why is because this is how we actually beam things up into space, apparently, for when we trade with people. Apparently, Ken could not make a wood electric tailing bench. Go figure. All right. We need to make, uh, we need to make a couple of items here. Oh, apparently, until you have that much. Loud crafting skill. Ah. That's interesting. Uh, why does that count towards uh, reading radius? I oh, need. Uh, actually, that's a good. That's a good. I didn't even think of that. Cook simple meal. Reading radius. I'm gonna make it low. Twenty-two. That way. That way, Pat doesn't go fucking halfway across the universe for this shit. All right. So, I want to make pants, right? And so it's saying that these things of pants are count towards my. Uh, pants requirements that I have. I don't know why it does. Uh, take the best stockpile when you're done. It's kind of weird. As far as 50 ingredients. What, what, what is the point of this, this bar here, I wonder, for the hit points? I, I thought it would be like, until I have X of so much, but... Okay, I guess we're going to just say do X times. So we're going to make one of, like, everything, basically. Uh, a little bit of everything. and I guess we're just going to have to handle it manually. Duster. Parka. Parka is good for certain things. Cowboy. Oh, dude, we totally need cowboy hats. Holy shit. Why would we not have cowboy hats? Alright. That's pretty good for that. And so it's someone who's very good at crafting is going to have to work on that. Uh... 
guess it might be uh, might be necromantic cat over here. Where is he? Oh, okay, he's not going to do that now. Oh my god, how many times are we going to fail this? Okay, this unfortunately needs power, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, orbital trade beacon. So, the thing we're going to have to do is we're going to have to just make it like a little power conduit coming over here. Can you, can you prioritize that, actually? There we go. Actually, we don't need that one. Kind of on the road and triggers me. There we go. So that should be pretty good. I mean, now, so now we have the uh, capacity to beam things into space. We could, also, we could actually extend this over here as well for our, uh, uh, for a little resource thing here, but that's fine. I like Pat's making things over here. Why? What's, how, what's Pat's crafting skill? What the fuck? He's number four on crafting? Why, why don't you just, like, use this? Like, why doesn't you do research? I, I actually I actually don't understand this at all because uh, his research is number three and his crafting is number four. Oh, it's, is it smithing? No, it's tailoring. It's tailoring. That's actually what it is. It just occurred to me it's tailoring that 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 it is. This guy actually is pretty good at tailoring. But okay, but like seriously, why is that the thing he does? I guess Master Fiddle decided to take it over, so Pat's like, I'll just do that. Uh, you know what? You know what, Pat? You're not even allowed to tailor anymore. Because he has like the lowest tailoring ability out of everybody. In fact, I'm going to turn a whole bunch of people off from doing, even being able to do that to begin with. I don't even know why they have it on. So we can now contact people also to bring them to our colony, but uh, there's no one I really want to kind of bring over here. Alright, we can also re re reinstall these things right here. So we have uh, stools everywhere else. I guess we can reinstall that one here as well. It's actually a really nice colony, you know. Oh, he's using the chair right now. It's actually neat that the game actually took that into account, that he's actually using the chair. Uh, maybe we should make a chess table or something, I don't know. Something nice. Fuck. Hey, hey, is he gonna move it? Is someone gonna move that? No. Why are you taking the uncomfortable chairs? Ah, oh, there we go. There, someone moved it. It's quite nice. Okay. Animal starvation. Why is the tortoise... Oh, shit, they're all in there. <laughs> Forgot about them. Don't worry, they'll, they'll unstarve themselves. I like how they go through the jail for that, too. Anyways, guys, I think we're going to cut it off here, guys. Uh, I hope you are enjoying this, and things are going pretty well right now, so... Uh, we'll continue this next time, guys. So everyone take care. Goodbye.